Hey guys, what's going on? I've got a new product from Zero Shoes, your favorite place for minimalist footwear, and something I'm really excited about that is quite different from what we've looked at before from Zero Shoes. Um, most of you know that they are famous for the barefoot sandal. Um, I have several pairs of those, and then they've branched out into running shoes for the road, also for the trail. Again, these are minimalist, barefoot-like running shoes um, that get you as close to the ground as possible with natural movement. Um, stand by these things 100%. Uh, love logging miles in them. But as most of you know, you know you can't wear your, your barefoot sandals everywhere that you want to wear them. Um, I'm dressed up more today because I just got back from work, a place that I probably couldn't get away with my barefoot sandals from Zero Shoes. Well, that problem is solved now with the new leather boot called the Melbourne. The Melbourne, as you can see, is a very classy, uh, very dressy shoe. Um, it is a full boot, very nice soft leather if you like leather boots. Um, it is a slip-on boot. It does have an adjustable zero shoe strap that you can see here. I have used this, it's very easy. Pull it here tighten if you need to or you can loosen this right here and get a little bit more room this just helps with the the tightness here at the heel to lock you in so you're not sliding around if, if you buy your boots a little bigger than you would your normal shoes um, these come out true to size this is a men's 11 and a half which is what I normally wear um, plenty of room but like I said it is secure it is fit you can look let's start at the very bottom of these things um, just so you see what you're getting in terms of how's a boot going to be minimalist? How's it going to be true to the live feet first motto that we've come to love with zero shoes? This is a very thin layer here at the bottom. Offers just enough protection that you need, um, but still lets you feel the earth beneath you. Um, when you move up here to the top, like I said, you've got the leather. Um, you have this material here, you see that contrast there. Um, it's pretty stretchy, um, so you don't have to tie these, they don't have ties on them. Um, it, it is a slip-on boot. Let's talk about how this thing feels, uh, where you're gonna wanna wear these. Like I said, um, I just wore these to a meeting for work. Um, they looked really, really good, um, kind of like a dressy boot again. Um, I've worn these out to the store in jeans as well, um, so they can go dressy, they can go casual, really wherever you want to go, um, but like I said, somewhere where you need to wear a more traditional shoe, the Melbourne is going to have you covered. It's going to have you looking great as well. Already got compliments on it when I took them out. Um, they're just a very sharp looking shoe, um, and again, something very different from, from Zero Shoe. This is coming out in the fall 2020 line, um, so be looking for these to come out on the Zero Shoe website. Um, again, can't recommend these things enough. Uh, same feel that you would get from a Zero Shoe, like the HFS, which is the road running shoe that I have, um, or their Terraflex, um, any of those that, that you're used to, you're gonna notice the traditional feel um, and the minimalist design of Zero Shoe. Um, that's a zero drop, so it's a flat shoe. Um, lets your, your foot move naturally in them. There is plenty of room here in this toe box, if you look at that. But they're not wide to a goofy point. I know some companies will make a really wide shoe um, that looks a little odd um, in the front to give those toes enough room. They've done a really good job designing this as a dress boot, casual boot, um, that looks very natural, um, just looks really good. So, but your feet do have plenty of room in here. Um, your toes have room to, to spread out and do their thing while you're doing yours. So again, this is the Melbourne from Zero Shoe. Um, go get you a pair and I'd like to hear how you like it. Thanks a lot.